what's up you guys, it's me Luke and welcome back to another video or if you're new here, welcome to my second channel. If you're new here, I have my main channel where I post my commentary slash critique slash reaction videos and over here I just post more fun, chill content and vlogs. Today's video is going to be a moving vlog. So yes, I know that I just moved what feels like yesterday when really it was six months ago. It was a really, really small studio apartment and being somebody who works from home and having had to stay at home so much because of the lockdowns, I resented that place and started to hate it. I was very lonely, my mental health with shit and it was just really hard to have a good home slash work-life balance. So my friend Holly wanted to go ahead and move out of home and I wanted to go ahead and move out of my apartment so we decided to go ahead and move in together. Now if you don't know who Holly is, she is my best friend in the entire world. I actually have a video on my channel where we kind of get drunk and share funny stories from our past and I tell you guys how we met which is actually a really funny story so if you want to go ahead and check that out I'll link that video up above and down below so you can go ahead and get to know Holly a little bit more and our friendship because you'll probably see a lot more of her on both of my channels. But yeah, we decided to go ahead and move into an apartment and I love this apartment. We've been living here for a week and already my mental health is doing so much better. It's just so nice to have so much more space, so much more separation of like relaxing, entertaining myself and like working. It's just, oh, it's so much better. But you guys will see the apartment in this video. It is almost done being furnished and decorated. So never fret, an apartment tour will be coming soon. But anyway, guys, I really hope you enjoy this moving vlog. This is my 11th place that I've lived in in Australia in the eight and a half years that I've lived here and my seventh place that I've lived out of home in the three years that I've been living out of home. Wow, I really do move a lot, but hopefully I stick around here for a while. I guess we'll just have to wait and see. But anyway, guys, without further ado, let's get into the moving vlog. Take it away, past Luke. Bye! <laughs> like real hard. So yeah, we got accepted for our apartment. It's <gasps> finalized. Congratulations, yeah. we did it. Y'all bitches doubted us. Period. Yeah. What's up, y'all? It's me, Luke, and Wally. And today we are starting our adventure of furniture shopping. Um, so Holly's got some connections or whatever. So we going in, we're gonna take a look. Even if we don't end up buying anything, at least we get a vibe, right? A vibe, we want, we're looking for vibes. We're period. Looking for vibes. <laughs> the start of a journey. Oh. The start of a new era. It was a Cultural reset. reset. Okay, grab my bag. Hey guys, so we're at Freedom Furniture. We have found a lot of great pieces that we like. Okay, come on, come on. This side table for the living room. This entertainment unit. This is the bed that I'm fighting with, with this kind of cushion gray sort of headboard. Holly just bought a rug. How do you feel? Rich. She feels rich, she feels bougie. We're literally in an expensive furniture store and Holly's shaking her mother ass. You can take the hoe to an expensive furniture store, but, but you, you can't, can't take, take the hoe out of the hoe. But you can't take the hoe out of the hoe, I don't know. <laughs> This bitch bought a rug. She's an adult or whatever. You see that? That's a motherfucking rug. I bought a rug. Period. Like, who's buying rugs? Adults. Period. You know what? She is gonna buy that rug. I am gonna leave and buy the rug. Alrighty, guys, so we- Okay guys, so we just finished at Fantastic Furniture. I put down a deposit on two couches that have to get delivered, so that's gonna take a while. But we got ourselves some bar stools. And I bought a rug. And we already told oh, them. Mm -hmm. But yeah, at least we accomplished some stuff today. Yes, we Period. We got a whole dining set this morning. Yeah, a whole outdoor dining set. And then this off tomorrow, I'm probably gonna pack, you'll pack. Mm -hmm. Friday, we'll pick up the keys, go clean the place, and then we can give you guys an, an empty apartment tour, so. Yes! Yes, see you then. Ooh. You may say, I'm a hey, just say, ooh, it feels like a party every day, hey, just say, dream my. Oh my god. Sorry, I just felt like I should. Yeah, I was like, just like a, a little, okay. Stopped. Hey, what's up, you guys? Hey, hey boo. So hey, today, you just say, ooh, picked up the keys hey. to our apartment. So we're gonna go in and show you an empty apartment tour. So exciting. Oh my god. When you walk in, 
Oh. And you walk in. Okay, it's like the main area, but over here is like a little hallway. The laundry. So it's already got a dryer, and we'll just bring our own little washing machine. And over here is just a linen cupboard and a cleaning cupboard. It's Holly's bathroom. <laughs> this is my shower. It's really big. Girl, I'm gonna put a room. stool in there so I can like oh, sit yeah. down. You lazy. Anyway, this is my toilet where she put the shit in. It's really good, like it's not that cramped. <laughs> <laughs> this is my room. My dad in here. My desk. It's really nice because like Holly's area is like completely separate from mine. Like she's got her room and her bathroom down this little hallway. And then when you walk here, this is the main living space. So first of all, I'll show you the kitchen. So it's a pretty nice kitchen. We have a gas cooktop. It's kind of limited into where you can put appliances there's literally only one plug so we're thinking of getting some sort of shelving thing over here so we can put some more appliances here but if you come around this side you'll see that we have a dishwasher which is so exciting because i freaking hate washing dishes me same. really good obviously your sink with a little detachment you can wash and douche your asshole <laughs> Um, obviously some more storage, some drawers, you know how it is, what do you do? It's a fat drawer. She's pretty fat. That's fat. She's thick. Thank you. <laughs> um, over here is a study nook, so this is where I'll be doing all of my video editing and whatnot. And then over here is the living space. Over here we'll just have the TV, some couches, a little dining area over here. And then up here we have this really big alfresco and outdoor area. It connects with in here, so it makes the space feel a lot better. These doors open up all the way. And Outdoor seating out there. We all have some friends over when we make some. Of I was gonna say when we have uh, some. And then over here is my bedroom. It doesn't have a window, but it has like a sliding door that goes onto the deck as well. And then over here is kind of a little walk-in wardrobe. It's a little annoying because there's no door here. This is open, so I'm gonna have to like keep this clean all the time. Which I guess is kind of a good thing. It will like force me to keep it clean. But I'm gonna like try and organize this really well. So I'm gonna try and make this good, good and, and beautiful and, and beautiful. aesthetic. This is the block. If you turn the light on, the fan's gonna go. Woo! Yeah, so this is the ensuite. So, you know, just got some storage in here, which is good for some, you know, booty supplies. Booty? Booty supplies. <laughs> booty supplies. Booty and booty. I'll probably just put a hamper here. And then just a shower. So, yeah, that's literally it. Anyway, guys, so that is our empty apartment tour. We'll take you along the furnishing journey. Obviously, it's a little boring right now because it's empty, mm -hmm. but. And a bit echoey. A bit echoey because it's got tall ceilings and there's nothing in it, but we are excited to go ahead and take you along for the journey. Period. Hey, just say, ooh, it feels like a party every day. Hey, just say. I like how we did it at the I same time. Like we didn't organize that. Hey. Hey. I forgot to vlog because I'm a really bad vlogger. We went to Sushi Train. We cleaned, we the, cleaned apartment. the apartment, yes. which is good. Not that it, it was pretty clean to begin with. Did the entry condition report. But we did our kind All of All that clean. kind of boring like, stuff. Nice. And then we just got done shopping at Kmart. But there's still a lot that we need to get because we have very particular taste. Look, uh, let's just say... We like really, the rich. We like the rich. We, we like, like the classy rich. look. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Even if it's not actually expensive, it's just got to look like it's, it is. Yes. Um, but anyway, we're going to go to JB Hi-Fi now to try to look for a TV and then Target and Big you to see what they got over there in the way of bougie plates and bowls. Mm -hmm. I want like something that looks nice, not just a plain white. You too much, but also just the right amount. Chromosome to do the hard work. Oh my God, why am I we do the hard work so every wild. day by just being the best gender. Nice Alrighty, guys. Hey, and just say. See what I have to live with. He just told me before we started this, please do not do the Jesse. We've done it too many times. Uh, I'm 
rebellion. Okay. I rebel against authority. So we at McDonald's, land of diabetes. We got ourselves some food and some food for the men. I got myself some fatties. Some food for the men who helped us move all our shit. So we've done a lot today, which is real good. Get me in the frame. I'm important too. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it, so. <laughs> No, that was nasty. Don't do that. That's she nasty. nasty. Sassy, moody, nasty. So yeah, we're just like getting all the furniture in. You vlog. You I, take over the channel. I literally am about to take over. Period. Just don't quit, please. Just don't quit. Just don't quit. This is that New York accent. You're from Long Island. Actually, I think it's more Boston. Holly heading out. Oh, New Jersey. Why do they all sound the same? Oh, oh. <laughs> Hello guys, um, sorry if I look like shit. I honestly just woke up and I haven't really done anything to my appearance. But today is another moving day. So I'm not sure if I've mentioned it or not, but we're kind of moving over a period of a week. So we have an overlap between my current lease and the next one, just because I didn't feel like having a stressful moving experience. So yeah, we're kind of doing little things every day. I have a lot to update you guys on, but I'll save that for when we get to the new place. But I have already started packing quite a bit here because me and Holly are moving some stuff today in her car. So this is what the apartment is looking like. Um, there's a lot of stuff that I still compact because I'm still gonna be living here for a few more days. But yeah, that's kind of just the update. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Hey y'all, back with hey Holly. Guys. Um, so we have packed the car full of stuff. Today we're moving a few more things and doing a bit more unpacking. And yeah, we can go ahead and give them an update because we haven't shown them all the new furniture no, and stuff true. like that. There is a lot in there. It ordered new, some furniture online. I'll show you that later. Which I haven't seen, but I trust you. Gotta your trust me. Period. Trust. We see each other. We good. We good. Hey guys, we have moved all the stuff up. We are really, really sweaty. Don't worry. If you sweat, if you melt my under boob sweat right now. <laughs> I'm literally drenched. So I'll show you guys the furniture. So this is kind of an update of everything. It looks a little messy because we unpack it or whatever. So this is Holly's room. She's got her bed and her bedside table. She's still waiting to get her desk. And then obviously she's just got a, a lot to unpack. I have, I'm a whole package. She a whole package or whatever. The washer and dryer, we got that in. <laughs> <laughs> My bitch. We got the kitchen. Um, I got these really nice stools from Fantastic Furniture. These are our dining chairs. We're still waiting for our dining table to be delivered, but these are really beautiful. This is made from bamboo. It's from... Oh, no, Cane, line. Cane line. Cane line Australia. Really pretty side table is from Freedom Furniture and it matches the entertainment unit. So it's a really pretty dark mango wood. And then this rug is from Freedom. At the moment, we're waiting for our car just to get delivered. So we're just using this outdoor yeah, furniture. Nice. Yeah, so that's our outdoor dining set over there. That's from Cane Line as well. My mattress over there, waiting for my bed frame. That'll come on Wednesday as well as my other furniture and then bookshelf dining table will come on Wednesday. That's pretty much it. That's the update. We're going to go to Kmart now to get a few more things and TK Maxx because I want to look at their bedding and stuff mm -hmm. like that. Maybe Bunnings. So we'll see you there. Period. See you there or, or be square. Be there or be square. <laughs> Period. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> so we have like a really, really hot neighbor. <laughs> So basically there's a guy who lives in the bottom apartment that uses his car spot as a gym and we joke that he's like four from Divergent because he lives in apartment number four and he's really sexy so we're going to try to seduce him or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> he's got really nice man titties. He's going to be mine! <laughs> Pretty one. Like yeah, that's a, that's a pretty towel. <laughs> hey, 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 beach. Pink wig, thick ass, give, give him whip flesh. Alrighty, guys, we are back. I didn't vlog too much, but we went to Kmart, TK Maxx, Woolies, and Bunnings and got a bunch of stuff. So I thought I'd go ahead and give you a homewares haul. I got this really cute little teapot where it's got like a thing where you like steep your tea in. I got three candles, which are really pretty. Mystical, and it is citrus, peel, and sage. La Luna, which is mandarin healing, which is pomegranate and orange. And then I got these two gray and black photo frames, these two gray photo frames, and then I just got a queen sheet set for my bed. We got these really soft 
dark pillows for our couches. And then I got these two wooden trays. I got this one for the gloss dining table. And then I got this one for our black coffee table. Just to go with our wood theme. Alrighty guys, so we set up the TV and we're just watching our favorite show at the moment. Oh my god, I love Oh these. my god, I love this show. Oh my god. You guys should really check it They're out. They're so pretty. They're so pretty. These actors, they're just beautiful. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. How nice is the TV? It's so big. She's chunky. She chunky. It's a smart TV. We got Netflix, YouTube, all that type of shit. So now we can watch my videos every day. Every <laughs> single yeah, day. Yeah, sure. Today is moving day four, so we're just moving a ton of more stuff, and it'll probably be our first night in the play. Look at that. The thing is packed to the brim. She good. Oh my god, guys, it is several hours later. We've just been packing stuff all day. My car is packed to the brim. I am so exhausted, I look like shit. But let's go ahead and unload this stuff. First night cooking in the new house. Yeah, we chefs or whatever, but we got some ratatouille up in this kid. So you're having vegan spaghetti bolognese. I'm having not vegan mango chicken curry. Alrighty, y'all, we are having our first glass of wine in the new house. We're yeah. such wine moms. We're such adults. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, boo. Just mm. as good as I remembered. Alcoholic beverages. We will see you every night, boo. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sweetie, for making life better. Why do I look like Pepper? Pepper! Pepper from American Horror Story. Who do I look like? A bad bitch. Period. You can't kill me. I'm a bad bitch. What is that? What is that? Oh, it's a stress pimple. Oh my god. Is that where that is that where stress one go? I don't know. I was just trying to make you feel better. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Hey you guys, hey. moving day. Bye. We spent our first night in the house. I slept really well, how about you? I slept good. I yeah. did. You slept on a mattress with nothing on it, with just a blanket, with all your makeup on. Yeah, I didn't even clean my face or shower. Wine or drunk. Bed. We were a little bit more wine drunk. We had a little, we got a little I too. wasn't. I, I, was. full, I full had a shower, I full did my skincare. Well, that's because I made my bed ciders. But we got a ton of deliveries this morning, so that's what we've been dealing with. We got my mirror delivered from Bunnings, my bed delivered from Freedom. <laughs> the NBN guy came, I got a delivery from City Beach. The NBN didn't work. Yeah, because we need to get our modem from our internet provider. But now we're gonna go ahead and put the bed together. So this will be fun. I'm getting Holly to help me. I'm roping her in. I don't do this. We're not I pay people to do this for me. We're not built for this. Oh, this is such a good angle. The half of this vlog is just gonna be us shaking our ass. <laughs> We've given birth. Now for the C section. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! It's so comfy. Whatever. Also, unpacked my mirror, which is looking super cute. It's super tall. Life hack, it's actually just a mirror that you put on a wardrobe door, which is a lot cheaper than other mirrors of size. It's so tall. It like is the same height as my door and it matches. Yeah, but we have a little um, predicament. <laughs> so I was washing my new bedding and then we just smell something. We walk over here, we see a trail of water on the ground. And yeah, so now there is water all over the floor because I put this where the water comes out in this hole because I thought that's what you're supposed to do. Oh my God, it started leaking more. But apparently you're not supposed to do that because then all of the water was just bucketing in there. So, so we're failing at being adults, but like we're trying. So. Yeah, we're trying our best, but we're having a few predicaments. <laughs> and now the whole place really fucking stinks like dirty laundry water. We have to go buy a mop because we don't have one. Alrighty guys, we're gonna do outfit of the day. So I'm just wearing this navy Tommy Hilfiger shirt. As you can see, these cute little shorts from Factory, you know, showing off the twist. <laughs> these blue socks from Rip Curl, and then my Converse. So I am wearing this top from Genda. These shorts are from Universal Store, and then these are the same socks as Luke, and then I've got Converse on. Cute, we match, you know, whatever. Mm, 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 Shaking mm, your mm, ass. Shaking his ass. Take it to the store. Okay, we're gonna walk to Woolies now to get some groceries. Alrighty guys, I don't know when I last updated you, but oh my God, the sun is blaring in my face. Um, we just went to Holly's parents' house to pick up the remainder of her stuff. <laughs> and then we just got the essentials. <laughs> yeah, you know how it is. Alcoholic wine mom. Literally. And then now we're going to TK Maxx. We're going to a different one that we went to the other day because this one is a lot bigger and it's got more stuff. But we are running really low because we had to help Polly's parents with some removalist guy who was really 
Stupid. Oh my god, that oh. was a story time and a half. Let's Remove this guy that smells <laughs> emotional and he like broke everything. Let's see if I take you oh in the store. Oh my god, that sun looks great on I know, me. kind of like golden hour teens. Hey guys, so it is several hours later. I think the last time we spoke to you, we were going into TJ Maxx. Ooh. I went We off. only had 40 minutes in that store, yeah. but let me say, that 40 minutes, we did a lot. I just chucked so much of my trolley. I had so much that I liked. It's too much to show yeah, you. I do want to give an update because the place looks very different because we just like had a burst of energy and did a lot of cleaning so here's the living room that's a new pillow and some new parts but it's looking a lot cleaner now we got rid of a lot of the boxes we got some couches. this is where a lot of the new stuff that i bought is just being left for now you can see there's like a lot of decorations i guess that's like a little sneak peek at some of the stuff that i got kind of a bit messy but it's like organized chaos the kitchen is really clean at the moment we're just having a little wine <laughs> just to treat ourselves because it was a big day only one gloss only one glass. Not that bad. It's not messy. I mean, we're still moving. You're still unpacking stuff. Yeah. We just brought stuff in. So I got my bed. I put up that painting over there. My closet is looking pretty good. But the most exciting thing is this beautiful painting from TJ Maxx. I got these are some new new pillows that I got. But this painting is so this pillow beautiful. Is, we, we both touched this pillow and looked at each other and went, oh, we're getting it. And I know. Like, you have to. It's literally the softest thing ever. Oh my god. But this painting is so pretty. It's like textured. I think this painting is gonna be like the muse for my whole room and yeah My room is just really looking like it's coming together. Obviously, I still need furniture to be delivered But that painting just looks so that painting <laughs> I'm fading when I look at that painting that painting just looks so Oh my god, I said it again. <laughs> that painting just looks so rich and expensive. It was only $80, but it looks like it was hundreds of dollars. It really accentuates the height. Of the ceilings, because yeah. this apartment's got really tall ceilings. Yeah, because I guess because the rooms are not like humongous. They've really uh, compensated that by lifting all the ceilings. That is the end of moving day five. I feel like it was a super successful day. Tomorrow we have to go and clean my old apartment, mm. and then I'll get to see it all empty. And that's like pretty Pretty much our last like solid moving day yeah. and then after that we pretty much just need to wait for the rest of the furniture to get mm -hmm. delivered so we can start unpacking but yeah we'll see you guys tomorrow Bye. Bye. it's moving day six i'm so freaking tired slept like crap my body is aching it's in a lot of pain i slept okay actually so Okay, well you don't have to brag. <laughs> okay, so we were both gonna go to my old place. Holly was gonna help me clean. But now I'm going by myself because we're getting furniture delivered. So Holly needs to wait here. I hate cleaning. But I will see y'all soon. Bye, bye, bye. Alrighty guys, so I'm here at my old apartment because I have to clean it up. And yeah, today's the last day that I have to be in here. So I need to clean it up. I'll go ahead and show you what it looks like. Obviously it's quite messy as that is what occurs when you're in the middle of moving. So I do have quite a lot to do. Um, this is kind of like my storage cupboard so there's just like a lot of junk in here I need to deal with. Take stuff off the walls. I do have quite a bit to do. I don't know I'll get back to you guys when I'm done and I'll show you the finished results. So see you soon. I'm not looking forward to this. Bye! Alrighty guys, so I didn't really do a vlog update today, but basically I was cleaning up in here, getting rid of the last of my stuff, doing a bit of cleaning, and I had to go back around lunchtime to help Holly take the furniture up because they didn't bring it into our apartment because of COVID. Yeah, and I couldn't do it by myself. No, um, so we did that, had lunch, and then came back, and we spent the past two hours cleaning. Thank you so much for your help. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys a final empty apartment tour of the place I've been living in for the past six months. Good riddance. I'm so happy to no longer be here. <laughs> Goodbye. But you know, it did its time. Let me show you what it looks like. So uh, we got the bathroom over there, toilet, shower, sink. Yeah, this place came furnished, except for, yeah, it did not come with that twerking girl. <laughs> you have to pay extra for that. Dining table, couch, with that hideous pillow that came with it. What's yeah, it does. Shitty TV that I never used, giant bookshelf, annoying tiny kitchen, but it did the job. Didn't even have a stove or an oven. This giant empty wardrobe. Bed, my wardrobe.
another one bites the dust. Let's do it. Let's do it. We just made a pit stop to Pillow Talk and Grandma I had to talk him out of buying a $700 chair. In my defense, it was a really beautiful chair. No! Yes! Okay, no. I'm getting a little insane with the spending at the moment. I either spend a ton of money at once or I spend nothing at all. But anyway, so we went to Pillow Talk and I got beautiful new bedding. I got blue linen. It doesn't look as good on camera. And then I got this throw pillow and um, I also got a new duvet and a new, new pillows and stuff. The reason that I'm doing this vlog update is to give you guys an update on the apartment and also because we got a bunch of furniture delivered today. Do you remember last night when we said, look how clean the place is, like it's so clean. Yeah, this is it now. Um, it's, <laughs> yeah, we're back in that state. Unfortunately, that's just what the moving life is like. Um, so we got new furniture today from Temple and Webster. We have our dining table, our coffee table, and this bookshelf that's gonna go here. All of it is flat packs where you have to put it together, but two of the pieces that we got were actually already put together in a box, so that's fun. This adorable little nightstand. And then I also got this standing shelf, which matches the side table, just because I didn't want two side tables because I felt like that was kind of boring. I just add something and I can put some decor pieces on here. So it's basically like a steel. I really don't know what color this wood is but I don't know I just think it ties in really nicely with the painting that's the update while Holly's making dinner I'm probably gonna go ahead and put together some of the furniture so maybe I'll show you that once it's done mm -hmm. <laughs> officially moved in. Obviously you saw yesterday that we finished cleaning up my place and we have gotten the lots of our stuff so pretty much all we need to do is unpack. And last night we got a bit crazy at like 11, 12 p.m. and built all the furniture. furniture. Yeah, got a bit manic. So um, we're gonna, well, I guess you can see a bit of a sneak peek in the background, but I'm gonna go ahead and end this moving vlog here because I'm gonna go ahead and save the actual stuff for the apartment tour eventually so it can be a surprise. But thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up, comment down below what you thought of it, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell, follow me on my social media and Holly, just link down below. And yeah, that's it for me in this video. I hope to catch my next one. And as always, I hope that you, you have, have a great, great day, day or night, night wherever you are in the world. world. Bye! Bye.